Hey, what's up? I'm sitting in front of my fancy new ring light that I got for Christmas, belated Christmas present. Thanks, Maria. Um, and today I wanted to talk about what's been happening recently uh, and all the thoughts that I've been having about COVID and staying at home. And in particular, like I've realized just recently that like my life for the last year and this year coming is not going to be what I want it to be. With lockdowns and varsity, maybe, maybe not going back in person. Lectures, probably not going to be in person. Probably not going to, I don't have an apartment at the beginning of this year at varsity. My life, my varsity life, my youth this year is not quite what I want it to be. And it's not quite the dreams and aspirations that I thought I was going to have this year. And that's okay. Like, I don't know if you remember the old serenity prayer I have it here, but God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, courage to change the things I can, and wisdom to know the difference between them. Um, and like, yeah, obviously I don't have the biggest problems in the world right now, but everyone's been dealing with COVID and been dealing with its ramifications in different ways. And I have not been able to have the usual varsity experience with an apartment, with lectures, with friends, no parties, no fun times. And that's okay, you know? You have to make the most of the situation given to you. So I've been doing some really deep thinking recently and I've come to the conclusion that I can't have those things, but I've got to make the most of the time that I've got right now and make most of the opportunities I've got right now. I've got more extra time at home at the moment, so I've got to learn things and spend time doing things that I wouldn't usually be able to do at varsity uh, during a normal semester time. I've got all this extra time, so I need to learn new coding languages. I need to spend time on doing Udemy courses that I've wanted to do for years. That's why I've been at the moment doing an AI Udemy course. I've been doing a Flutter Udemy course. I did a web development Udemy course. Those are things I wanted to learn for a long, long time and didn't get to do it because Varsity was sucking up all my time. But now that I'm at home more, um, and especially with this long holiday and that you can't see as many friends, can't go out as much, just gotta make the most of it. Gotta take advantage and use it to your benefit. And so I've been doing that recently. And so if you don't hear from me a lot in the next couple of weeks and months, it's because I'm working on those things. I'm working on those things that I wouldn't usually be able to work on and that aren't fun to film. It's not fun to film me sitting and learning for hours at a time how to use Microsoft Azure and how to do Azure functions. Because it's not fun to talk about that stuff, but learning it is super cool and super useful for my maybe career one day or projects that I want to build or even a business I want to build one day. I've long, in my, long since in my mind, toyed with the idea of entrepreneurship and wanting to be an entrepreneur, owning my own business or project or something. And so learning the skills and technologies and tools that will help me do that is a really valuable use of my time now at home. Um, and so, yeah, I'm just trying to learn the things that I normally wouldn't. Firebase, Microsoft Azure, um, cloud computing, AI, the stuff that I might have learned in a couple of years when I had some time off for that, but now just use that time to my advantage. You know, got to work on projects, videos, ideas, businesses, websites that I wouldn't usually have the time for and just use this time to my advantage. And I encourage you to do the same. If you're out there struggling, as we all are, to like come to terms that you're not going to have a, a nice start to your varsity year. We all thought 2021 COVID would be over and like we'll go back to normal. We're going to. I think the vaccinations and that are going to start rolling out a lot faster than we all think and that by the end of the year, things will be pretty much back to normal. But that's a long time still. That's many, many months of perhaps staying at home or staying inside in your apartment. And that's time that you can use to your advantage. Learn cooking, learn arts and crafts, you know, build, start a business, start a blog, start writing, anything that you might have left for a couple of years for one day. Do it now while you've got time. Because at the moment, socializing, parties, getting together with friends, you can do it and you should be doing it. Socializing is important, but you can't do it in the way that I'm sure a lot of us would like to in big groups, often frequently seeing people from all over the country. Um, I'm going to be to Varsity in like a week and a half time just for a two-week holiday module and I'm really excited to see my friends but I'm not sure after that what the rest of the year is going to be like in terms of seeing people in terms of hanging out with them in terms of spending quality time with young people my own age and so I'm going to take full advantage of it and then if we have to go back if I have to go back home after this because I don't after that because I don't have an apartment I'm going to go back home and I'm going to take full advantage of it and carry on working on my job I'm going to learn more uh, AI and web development I'm going to do my best to build a few of my own personal projects like really take advantage of this time I'm 21 years old got my whole life ahead of me really to be young and to do fun stuff and to enjoy my youth really and so now in the short time that COVID has given us to stay at home really or forced to be stay at home and work on personal passion projects, I think it's a good opportunity to, to do that. And so this was just a quick motivational blog. If you're out there and you're thinking about 
um, what you can do to make your life happier right now or what you can do to take advantage of the COVID situation or of however it has affected your life or has uh, you know made your life not what you thought it would be this last year I encourage you to take advantage of it and yeah obviously this is not a big problem like the world is suffering right now people are going through a lot more difficult things than not being able to see friends and varsity but just because other people have worse problems than you don't mean your problems still aren't meaningful and so yeah that's what i wanted to say thanks for watching this video and so if you don't hear from me it's because i'm busy grafting my ass off talk to you soon